two boats and a helicopter. A terrible storm hits a small town, and floodwaters rise rapidly. A faithful man stands on the steps of a building, praying for deliverance, when a man in a rowboat comes by and offers help. Better get in the boat, my friend. The water is rising fast, says the man in the rowboat. The faithful man waves him away. No, thank you. I have faith in the Lord. He will protect me. Later, a man in a speedboat comes by, and the faithful man is forced to retreat to the bell tower. Get in, man. The dam is going to break, and we'll all be washed away, says the man in the speedboat. Again, the faithful man waves him away. No, thank you. I have faith in the Lord. He will protect me. As the floodwaters continue to rise, the faithful man is forced to climb to the very top of the steeple. A rescue helicopter flies overhead. Grab the ladder, my friend. The dam is broken and the water is coming this way fast, shouts the rescue crew. The faithful man waves the helicopter away. No, thank you. I have faith in the Lord. He will protect me. Unfortunately, a huge wave of water comes rushing in, and the faithful man drowns. He confronts God in heaven and asks why he wasn't saved. My Lord, I had faith. I prayed to you. Why didn't you save me? Asks the faithful man. And God says, My child, I sent you two boats and a helicopter. What more did you want from me? The moral of the story is that sometimes we get so caught up in our expectations of how things should be that we miss out on opportunities that are right in front of us. It's important to keep an open mind and be willing to accept help from unexpected sources, even if it doesn't come in the form we expect. <laughs>